Congratulations for you. Welcome back to my channel. It is Wednesday the 19th of May and I am vlogging because I do have a very exciting day today. I will be going to college and I will be doing hot stones at college and then after that I will be seeing Scott. So I'm going to vlog because I need to vlog more interesting things and today is kind of like an interesting day. So I'm going to grab my phone now. I'll film as much as I can today. I promise you guys, I will. But this morning, I woke up at around 10 past 8 and I did have a college call for an hour uh, from 9 until 10 o'clock and it was just some like revision because we do have a lot of exams coming up. Well, I say a lot of exams. We probably only have like uh, probably three or four left maybe or maybe even five. But <laughs> yeah, so like I hope you will be finishing college probably by mid-June if I'm lucky. Um, I'm hoping fingers crossed I will be able to. So yeah, but I do have I do have my college tunic on because I will be setting off at around 20 past 12. I usually walk to college because like it only takes 25 minutes to get into town because my college is in town. It isn't really like a bad walk to get there really. So yeah, but I did my makeup before the call. Um, so like I've just gone for like my natural kind of brownie look and I've actually got on a new pair of eyelashes. Oh my god, they are so unreal. Like, oh my god, I am obsessed with them. They are the so two the New York ones. I didn't even have to cut these down to like my eye shape. Like, they fit my eyes perfectly. They are they're really easy to apply and they look like eyelash extensions, like the hybrids are like the Russian ones. Like, oh my god, they're so good. And for five pounds, they are a bargain. But I actually got these from like my in my old work uh, colleagues as it kind of made me you know, like a little kind of like a leaving present in the box and these eyelashes were in them so i'm just a bit and oh my god these eyelashes are beautiful <laughs> yes that's what i have my eyes and the eyeshadow palette i've been using lately oh my god i i have been obsessed with it it's the morphe 35 xo valentine's day palette so i bought this after valentine's day I had just been at the morphe shop and oh my god it's actually stunning i use this shade just friends there the brown shade there is absolutely gorgeous so yeah but i'm feeling pretty confident today because like i've curled my hair and i mean ever like i have a full face of makeup on and curl my hair i always feel really happy and like i want to enjoy life you know but i'm not gonna lie this past kind of week or maybe even couple of weeks i've been really feeling self-conscious about my skin because if you guys do not know i recently got the coil fitted probably like um, probably five i think i've got it fitted around five weeks ago now and the reason why i wanted the coil fitted is because i was previously on the pill with jivy don or whatever you call it and oh my god it was making me have awful mood swings like i was just feeling like like out of it all the time and i was always sore now and everything so i decided to ring the doctors and book an appointment to get the coil fitted and i do have the non-hormonal copper coil because i was adding artificial hormones into my body with the pill i felt as if the best idea was just to get the copper coil so that, like it wouldn't release any hormones and it would just release the copper instead so i did that i've had the coil in first i've had the coil for five weeks after i stopped taking the pill i did have like a a pill period because you always have one when you're on your break and the pill that i was on i did have like a week's break of it so i had the pill period as normal when i had the coil in me um and these past two weeks i'm not even joking my skin has actually broken out like oh my it's actually so bad um you probably won't be able to tell because i do have like a full face makeup on to cover it up in my skin it was almost getting to the point where it started to look like acne and like my spots were really like red and angry and some of them had like the white heads on them and I, I literally felt so self-conscious about it and I've been quite lucky with my skin because considering I do have oily skin anyway I am prone to getting a lot of blackheads, oiliness, a lot of spots and everything especially like around my period as well I was really meant to be having a period 
on a coil around the stage but I still not had one so I don't know if my periods are going to stop on this coil or like if they're going to be a bit delayed or irregular for like the first few months because like it is normal for like you not have a period on the coil for the first few months so I'm kind of waiting to have my period but my skin was literally awful and my sister actually has the Mario Badescu drying lotion and I put it on my skin last night because I was honestly feeling super self I was honestly feeling super self-conscious about my skin and like I literally cried to my mum last night so and my sister had a little bit of the Mario Badescu drying lotion left over and it kind of has dried up I did wet a little cotton bud and dipped it in and oh my god I woke up this morning and a lot of spots like on my chin and on my cheeks have cleared up like you probably won't be able to tell but I had like a big spot there like I usually do have like a lot of small ones on my forehead I don't know if it's because like I eat too much sugar or it's my oily skin or what but I always have like small ones on there but this has been helping I'm going to use this twice a week and like I only put this on overnight and my skin it looks so it must look so much better already so I highly recommend if you're suffering if you've really bad spots or acne and try this and my mum bless her actually ordered me some skincare from Beauty Bear bless her I think she ordered me the, the Mario Badescu acne facial cleanser because I am in need of like a new cleanser I'm currently using the soap and glory gel cleanser which is like the perfect uh, first wash for my skin because I do have oily skin and gel and gel face washes or cleansers are perfect for oily skin because this face wash was kind of targeted to acne she ordered me that one and and then i think she might have ordered me like a pierce or something for my skin so hopefully it, it'll all work out i think it's either meant to be arriving today or tomorrow so um i will let you know what my thoughts and opinions are on those two products she's ordered me but she was so cute um and she told me to come down and have a look online on Beauty Bay and like she ordered them. I was like, oh my god, you are so cute. And so when I get to Scots today, we will be getting trained to like another little town where he lives because we don't actually live in like the same area. We live 45 minutes away from each other now and uh, yes, I live in a city and he lives in a town. So it does take a while to get to his sometimes. But, yeah, so, when I finish college, I'll have to walk home because it takes me half an hour to get home and then I'll have to get dressed into, like, my outfit. I've already got it on the chair over there. I'm going to be wearing, I'm going to be wearing the greeny top and black pants um, because we will be going bowling. So, I kind of want to wear something kind of comfortable but also a very nice outfit as well. So, yeah, so, like, I'll just have to get in. I'll have to get changed. I'll have to have a quick snack and then... I'll have to head out because I think the train is at around half six. So, yeah, um, well, I'll just have to quickly nip in here and then head off straight there because it does take 45 minutes to get to his house. But yeah, I'm going to stop talking because I am actually really hungry as well. So, it's nearly 11 o'clock, but I will have to set off for college at around 20 past 12. So, I'm kind of thinking, I'm going to have an early lunch. I'm kind of thinking you chicken going to some more frozen beans because like, it's just like an easy outfit. I mean, Easy outfit, I mean, it is an easy meal. <laughs> oh my god. Like, I don't know why, but today, I seem to be talking really fast and I'm getting my words mixed up. Oh yeah, oh my god, I'm really sorry if you're asked to hear my voice right now, but I've also got something else which I need to show you all. <laughs> because I haven't vlogged for like a whole week or so, yeah. my life has completely changed lately, like, I don't know why. So basically, if, if you, you may know, I do actually own a few cactuses and they're all from Ikea and these two they used to be like in tiny little pots so when my dad repotted them as the roots were literally hanging out the like the bottom of like the plant pot if you know what I mean so he's repotted those and these here they used to be in this pot over there and they've actually repotted it into like a new pot but you went to look at plant pots yesterday you can't find any to match a room or the ones that fit these ones so far so i'm currently trying to look for <laughs> the plant pots to put these in but for now i've had to keep them on a tray a couple of baby ones in here as well just so that they're able to grow together you know and flourish so yes this is 
the, the current state of my windowsill right now and the plant situation. I repotted this one a while ago. This one used to be tiny, but it's now blooming. He's called Larry in case you're wondering. I don't mind calling him Larry, but he's cute and fairy, so that's why I like that. <laughs> oh god, I'm so weird. But yes, that's the current situation of the windowsill right now. So yes, so I've already packed my whole doll for Scott's house because I can't I'm only gonna be staying for one night because I do have a new job and I usually have to be asleep by nine o'clock. Um because I do get up for four o'clock in the morning. So I will be staying over at his house and then I will have to go home on Thursday and also get an early night because I will be working from from Friday to Saturday this week and the next week I will be doing Thursday to Friday, I think. Oh but I mean it's got they're meant to be going away to Glasgow for three nights, I think. So, but obviously, in Scotland, they're like a bit stricter, aren't they? So, I'm not quite sure if the rules are going to change there. The thing is different in Scotland compared to the UK, like England. So, we don't know what's going to be happening there. But, if we've booked the train and the hotel anyway, but if not, I have to pay for the hotel yet. Just in case, like, anything happens with COVID or, like, the rules and stuff so yeah i'm meant to be going away but anyway i'm gonna shut up now <laughs> and i'm gonna put the oven on because i am actually really hungry i did have a chocolate bar for breakfast but i wasn't going anywhere so it's fine like i was gonna be having an air lunch anyway so it's fine so yeah i'm gonna put the oven on have some food and yeah Enjoy my lunch because I am so hungry. Oh, we've got now at bowling. It's cheap in here for a yeah. pint. Oh, Sorry, hello. <laughs> Hi. This is me. You're also interested um, in nice clothes. I'm going to get the compact strike so I can't. I'll, I'll have to cut this bit of footage a lot. But yeah, this is bowling. The gun then. Look at that. Oh. No, you missed them. Cut that out. You've got to be bowling. I love the way you. Oh wow. Go, go, go. Yay. A date free. Oh, I'm filming now. Go on then. Go on. Oh, are you going to get it? Oh, what's the cut? They're based on cherry cider, it's people's fine. Uh, yeah, they are alcoholic. Chin chin. Cheers. Just put the thing. Oh, blast. In spoons now. Awful lighting, but you know, oh my god. You've got some pictures, you've got a high with your meal. You've got the mango one and the rhubarb one. I have work in the morning. Oh my god, do you? And a wedding cake to do. And the birds are cake. Well, it's fine. You alright? Living life on the edge. Yeah, we are indeed. You took a picture? <laughs> oh, for God's sake. What? I'm wet. Yeah, this one is unreal, by the way. I've not tried the rhubarb one yet, but the mango. Is it horrible? It's like water. Is it? Have a taste of it. Pour me a bit in your glass. It's a spritz, so it's like wine. Oh. Oh, that? There you go. Our food has arrived. You've got a cheeseburger. Our first meal out in six months. Oh my god, I know. Get away the spoon. <laughs> chicken have a mushroom pizza. Chicken bites are absolutely unreal in case you're wondering how fast the chips on the yeah. pictures. <laughs> nice. Happy meal, man. Woo! In the train station, like, I cannot wait to spoons, guys. Um, no, we're not on our way to spoons. Oh no! <laughs> it's on the way home, I mean. Look at that view. The view over there looks really Look nice. That's oh Scotland God. over there. Look. It's really nice, I know. Yeah. So, um. It looks nice, it does. Oh yeah. yeah. We've got like a couple of pictures, and one of them is really nice, and one of them just tastes like water. Like, we've got like a mango one, which is really nice, but the rhubarb one it tastes like water, doesn't it? That's where we walked before, look. Oh yeah, this is you. Oh my god, that's, oh, that's really nice on the camera. It's really loud, no, 
It's really loud now, guys. Like, I'm, I mean, it's Our like. picture was leaking, wasn't it? So we had to ask for another one. Oh, yeah. Isn't he all over us? I know. Alice has had too much to drink, bless her. I'm not. Hey, everybody. As you guys can probably tell, it's the next day now. But the reason why I'm like the vlog this morning is because we kind of had a bit of an incident last night. Basically, when we were walking, like, back to scott's house from the train station they were kind of messing about a little bit but like they got they kind of barged into me like accidentally and he ended up pushing me over but i'm like i think it's because and like he is a heavy person compared to me but anyway as soon as that the moment happened i literally like i grabbed my phone out and like in my hand and this is the current state of my phone right now like it's really hard to tell, but like, it's kind of smashed on there. So like, I hope that, that the audio like on the phone is okay. But yeah, so your know, phone is kind of smashed on their side there. Um, so I was really annoyed with him. It's fine. And I also kind of grazed my uh, hand as well. So like, I'm really sorry if you guys hate blood. I'll put like a, a warning on before I show you this, but yeah, it's so really painful. But the day she has been my little doctor today, she's been looking after me. And dogs, and dog saliva, um, is really good for healing wounds and stuff. So look at this. Hello, hello. Yeah, look, she licks it. Look. Yeah. Are you in the vlog today? You in the vlog today? Oh, oh bless us. So Scott's gone to work. I think he'll be back at around like twelve-ish, probably. So I'm looking after Daisy. I'm just out for parcels as well, and I've also had my breakfast. I just had like I just had a slice of toast. But Daisy, does that what does that smell of? Oh no, it's not bothered now. I think it's a bit sleepy. Yeah, she's so cute. And yeah, you're famous now. You are, you're famous. But anyway, guys, um, I think I'm going to end this vlog here because, oh my God, it's starting to bleed. Oh my God, it actually really hurts, guys. Like, yeah. Is this going to start out there? I think it could be. But I'm going to end this vlog here. So I really hope that you guys have enjoyed this vlog if you have make sure to leave a thumbs up a comment down below and i'll see you all in my next video Bye.